Right, so I finally received my Raspberry Pi. For those who don't know, it's a credit sized computer mainly aimed at education. I ordered mine from RS Final, so I got the Model B 512MB RAM Revision 2 model with a nice simple case also. It's actually tiny. You can only really appreciate how small it is when you see it, but it's literally the size of a credit card. The board seems quite solid, and I'm happy with the strength of the device ports. The device is intended to encourage IT in schools, and it does. It's cheap, educational, and enjoyable for any this age. This board has two USB ports, a LAN port to connect to a router, a HDMI connector to connect to a TV, a composite out, which is uh, useful for connecting on TVs, which are the yellow, white, and red cable rather than the new HDMI standard. There's a micro USB port here, and uh, yeah, that's for power. And there's a standard 3.5 millimeter jack here as well for headphones. The SD card sits here at the bottom. So uh, the board uh, has a 700 megahertz processor, which can be overclocked to one gigahertz with the new turbo mode, which doesn't affect your warranty. As mentioned before, this is the 512 megabyte RAM version. Uh, this has almost identical spec to my computer from 10 years ago, which is quite worrying. Anyway. I've managed to easily install an operating system on this and I could run XMBC, which is quite a demanding application, smoothly on the device, which is great. Overall, I think this is quite an effective device for a cheap price. The only criticisms I have is the SD card sticks out the side of the Pi, there is no screw mounting holes, and connecting a hard drive to the device is not that easy. The Pi is great, it can be used for a variety of purposes. I'm personally going to use it as a media center. But some others have connected LEDs and stuff to GPIO pins and have made some interesting things. So I can easily recommend this as a Christmas present as it suits a wide, suits a wide age range and is pretty cheap.